Let's uh, take a look at the weather for your Sunday morning, and we will cross to Tim Davies now, who He's has a the very latest. Now, by the way. He is a red He's head. A red head, yeah. Where is he? What are you Good doing? Good morning, team. Yeah, there's lots of people heading out for a cycle this Sunday morning. It is a lovely morning here in Sydney. We're at Sydney Motorsport Park and uh, learning some driving skills for life. James Stewart here beside me. James, um, lots of people hitting the roads this morning on two wheels. And for us on four wheels, we need to take extra special care of them, don't we? Yeah, without a doubt. Like a lot of young drivers out there just don't know how to give cyclists enough room. So this year we're partnered with the Amy Gillett Foundation to mm -hmm. try and get that message out about giving cyclists a metre at least. Yeah, all right. Got a great tip for you guys, really practical, that everyone can do in the car today. Going to show you that right after we take a look at our weather on this Sunday. All right, well, James, a very practical a way to make sure that we look out for cyclists on the road. While you're sitting behind the wheel here, what can you do? Well, basically, when we've actually parked the car, actually using our left hand, and what it's called is a Dutch reach. So by using your left hand to open the door, that will twist your whole body to be able to look over behind your to see the cyclist. OK, all right. So there we go. Rather than just using my normal right hand as you do, flick open that door and risk someone's life, now I take my left hand and it makes me more conscious of exactly what is coming. So Sarah, as she's riding along here, has a metre. As you can see here, guys, a metre certainly does matter. We've just saved Sarah's life and we didn't want to clothesline her by opening that car door there. So good on you, Sarah. Off you go on your bike off for your Sunday ride. Gang, more great tips on how to stay safe on our roads on this Sunday. Coming up for you in half an hour. See you soon. Yeah, Tim, that was really simple. Just changing hands makes a little bit of difference. All right, mate, I'll speak to you soon.